Hey everybody, uh, I said that I would like to do some cooking videos and today I'm actually cooking so I'm going to try to do a video for you even though I don't really have uh, the camera that I want or any editing software at the moment to do a real demo for you but I can kind of show you what I'm doing. I'm actually filming this with my laptop but uh, if you just come over here show you what I got going on. Okay, so here sorry All right, right here in my cast iron Dutch oven show you what I got working in here I got on low heat cover and what I have in here is one large sweet potato a handful of carrots one red pepper and a couple of broccoli stems diced up and just kind of simmering away in my Dutch oven and uh, while that cooks I'm gonna dice up a uh, three large chicken breasts and we're going to add that them in there season that with a little salt and pepper and I'm going to thicken it with a little bit of flour, you just dust a little bit of flour right onto what you're sautéing and that'll make a roux right there in the pan with the food and then to build the stock for the stew that I'm making, I should have told you I'm making a stew I'm going to use a little bit of this wine, just any wine you have laying around the house, I'm using a white because that goes well with chicken sometimes that's what you're into. Uh, this is a Moscato de Asti, pretty cheap, simple wine. And doesn't it? It doesn't have to be really expensive wine when you're cooking. Just anything that you would drink, go ahead and cook with it. And after I've got my stock built, and I've got my chicken added, and that's cooked for uh, long enough for the chicken to start browning. Right at the end, in my work bowl here, I have some broccoli florets and chopped up mushrooms and any large mushroom that you like will do I'm using portobello's because I really like those and uh, yeah I'm just gonna let that slow cook and get nice and stewy and delicious add a few herbs of my choice at the end anything that you like go ahead and add it in this is really simple dishes like this are really open-ended you can really do them any way you want um, so yeah I wish I could show you like a real demo but uh, like I said I'm working with limited resources right here and uh... yeah so that's that's pretty much it have a good one